Ouch. But it's National Cheeseburger Day, so that's something to celebrate. Yes. Adam Kovac is here. He's the executive chef for Breadwinners, The Quarter Bar, Henry's Majestic. You got that's a lot right. going on. You're busy, busy. I stay busy. That's right. <laughs> there you go. So we're making a cheeseburger today, but you're kind of putting a twist on it. You're making it a little hot. We are. We're doing the green chili jalapeno bacon burger from Breadwinners. There's nothing so about it's that. Wow. There's nothing about that I can't embrace. If you're going to yeah. celebrate <laughs> National Cheeseburger Day, you've got to go all out. Yes. <laughs> all right. So what are we doing here? So we're going to start with our burger patty. Yeah. Um, we keep it pretty simple at the restaurant. We just stick to beef. We don't add a lot of flavors. Uh, we use a real nice high, high quality beef. We use an Akiyushi, which is a Texas Kobe beef. You can okay. use whatever you want from the store. Um, we kind of press ours up so they're nice and uniform. Um, we actually prefer to cook them in a pan, so it, it, it may not sound really? as healthy, but it kind of cooks in its own fat. Okay. Um, it so stays nice of, like, and on juicy. A grill, you do it on the pan. Absolutely, you're not going to get those flare ups like you would have on the grill. Okay. So we just do a nice, uh, nice amount of salt and pepper there. And, um, and then right into the pan. And what do you cook that in? Um, so this is just in a little olive oil. Olive oh, well, oil, okay. And so, um, and then depending on how, you know, how you like your burger, if you like right. a nice uh, medium, medium rare, uh, about four minutes aside, three minutes aside. Okay. Depends on how thick. Um, and then we just kind of let that go. Um, one of the keys to a great burger is once you pull it off of the heat, you, you need to let it sit and reabsorb its juice just okay. like a, like a For how long? Steak. How long does it need uh, to sit? Just a few minutes, you okay, know, so maybe five long. minutes. Okay. Um, and then we'll usually throw our cheese on, you know, kind of yeah. towards the end. Let me see that there. What, what kind of so, cheese? Uh, are you so, so for this burger, we use uh, we use a nice pepper jack cheese. Okay. So nothing too sharp, but it's got a nice little zing. All right. And then, um, and then the my favorite part about this burger is the jalapeno bacon. Oh, this, this is jalapeno bacon. So we've got regular bacon that I brought along here, and then this is jalapeno bacon. It's How actually do you do cured that? with jalapeno powder, so it's oh, got a nice little goodness. zing. <laughs> Oh, it's you delicious. spilled the secret. Okay. So, you, and what else? What else you put on the burger? So we uh, we start this burger out with a little bit of mayonnaise okay. on the bottom. Um, you can use, you know, a lot of people like ketchup or mustard, but with this burger, there's so many flavors with those chilies. We just stick to the mayonnaise. Smart. I like to do that on the bottom. Okay. We do a little lettuce, tomato, whatever your favorite accoutrement is. <laughs> you guys sell a lot on. of burgers. We sell a lot of burgers. We do them uh, breakfast, lunch, dinner, brunch. All the time we're selling burgers. It's, mm. it's pretty wild. And this one's available at all of which restaurant? Is this one's available at uh, all four of our Breadwinners locations. Oh, okay. Yeah, all you've right. got Breadwinners, what, Uptown, uh, on Inwood, North Park. I know there's a Plano location Plano I've been location. to as well. So Absolutely. I cover them all? I think I covered them all. That's right. Lots of locations to so check plenty, out. So uh, plenty throughout the Metroplex to try this guy out. And the last thing you're putting on there? And this is the, um, this is kind of what kicks it up a notch. And this is, uh, this is basically roasted jalapenos and roasted poblanos that have then been peeled and just kind of rough chopped, pureed a little bit. And, uh, and we just put that right on top of this burger, and it's really what adds that nice zing. That'll do it. Okay, so we're going to put this recipe and also a link to Breadwinners and the other restaurants on our website, fox4news.com. Happy National Cheeseburger Day. Adam, thank you so much. Thank